Okay, mark the stampede here. I have quite a bit to unpack tonight. Um, I went to Walmart. Um, here, let's do this one thing. Let's. Okay, so I ordered these on eBay. Some three 2020 Prism Panini Prism pack NFL packs. I went to Walmart today. They had. I went to Walmart, Target, and to Costco. To, well, I had to go house, but not for cards and Target today. Walgreens and not to look at, not to get cards specifically. I was had to go to all this place for other reasons, but only Walmart had cards. But I was able to get at Walmart. I was able to pick up some wild cards and some 2020. Some a lot of a lot of Chronicles. I know I hate Chronicles, but this is the first. I always complain about how lame Chronicles is as a product, but this is the products for the first. The first 2021 2022 NBA season, so I, was, so I was too excited. And they had, as, it, as you can see, the three separate configurations at Walmart, which is pretty crazy. Um, but let's start with football. And you can see, might be able to see in background some of my football cards up. Um, all right, but let's start with this. So I bought three packs off of eBay, it was almost $100. I thought I was buying booster pack booster boxes. Uh, I was, it was like one in the morning. I was, this is a cautionary tale about not buying stuff at late at night. Um, but I mean, this one pack is sixty. It was last time I bought one at the card shop, my local card shop, it was sixty dollars. So getting three for ninety is actually a good deal. But I, I think you can find. I don't know. I think I was also seeing like. The whole booster boxes for like between 70 and 125 on like Dave and Adam, Dave Adams and uh, Still City Collectibles and eBay. So not the greatest, but hopefully we'll get something really good to make up for it. So let's open these first. All right, let's see what we got. Um, Matt Stafford's on the Lions. Brian Burns. Cameron Haywood. Ooh, look at this. Orange Prism, Sean Alexander, and is that, what do you call that? Disco? Mojo? That is a cool card. I like that card. Um, what it's worth. Uh, so 2020, so we Travis, you trying to, we want to pull a Herbie. Just, or Joe Burrow. Oh, I've got a decent amount of Joe Burrow cards already. I don't really have any great Herbert card or yeah I don't really have any great Herbert cards I have these I have some decent Joe Burrows though um I have my Chase Young collection I'm done with it and now I don't want to pull any more Chase Youngs okay Emmett Smith KJ Wright Jamichael Hasty, Orange Pro oh, say Josh Ook uh I don't remember how if he was any good or not uh but that, um, that pack got two, pulled us two separate uh, rookies, so that's not bad. But hopefully we get like a really good, or something really good from this next pack. Um, all right, well, let's see, some last pack mojo. Before we move on to the wild card. They also had, so, well, I guess we'll talk about more in a second. Um, oh, Austin Eckler, running back, cool. Debo Samuel, okay, not the rookie card you want. Michael Warren the third. All right, and this card would have been worth more last year. Orange Prism, Frank Clark, not having a great year. No, the Chiefs are down in general, but. Still a nice card, and he could probably turn around. He's got a he's had a decent career, so maybe he might have a down season. That's okay. Okay, all right. So let's get our stack of cards. Let's put the stack of cards over there. All right, and let's move on to um our. But anyway, the whole thing about this is buy what I would I still recommend this is you 
you go to like Steel City Collectibles or Dave Adams World or wherever blowout cards, or you find and you set you see how much a car how much they're selling the booster box or mega box for, and then you go to eBay and see if somebody's selling it for cheaper. But then don't make sure it's not don't say pack break empty for some reason people do that um or something crazy like case only make sure that you're actually actually getting a box with that has been opened um and then make sure i i've only done people that have 100 percent ratings i know that's not always gonna be possible but if, they don't have, if like if i can't find something that's 100 percent ratings it'll just go back to i'll go back to like an actual reputable site okay but at walmart they had wild cards um so I picked up two of these. They didn't have any other sizes. It was just for me. I think there may have been some like a twenty, like a small, like a like just packs, but they were gone. They were sold out. Looked like they might have been or a smaller box, but that seems like that was sold out. Um, and like I said, they had every version. They had all these different sizes of the NBA Chronicles. They also had Panini Prism. Um, Panini Prism Baseball, but that's not licensed by MLB, so I wasn't really interested in picking that up. Um, that was pretty much it. I think they might have had some... Oh, what did they have? They may have had some Hawk. They didn't have any other baseball, the, and the Donruss football sold out. Um, but yeah, there was no Bowman Chrome or Bowman Sapphire Tops Chrome like I got last time was at Walmart. And at Target, it's pretty... like I haven't seen really seen anything... I've seen some Pokemon cards at Target, uh, but nothing was there today. No, no Pokemon cards at all. There was there. So for some reason, the, the Tops complete set has been at Target, and it's always been there. So that must, that must have any parallels in it or something. So like 683 cards, and there's some I think some Upper Deck hockey stuff, but it looked like I don't know. It didn't look like it was actually cards. I wanted stickers. And then I don't know. The, I think the whole thing with the Walgreens, you have to know which day they're stocking. And the, um, uh, I haven't picked. I got score cards there at the beginning of the like right at the end of the summer, and not I haven't seen any sports cards since then. And I got Evolving Skies Pokemon when it came out, but I, the Pokemon's have been all sold out every time I've gone there since then. Um, there was some Pokemon last time I went to Target, but. The deal, like it, it wasn't as good as the deals on um, at, you get at Walgreens, and they were older. They were older packs. Okay, so I I know that this is not going to be um. So th this is just basically what well, I, I guess it's kind of like Sage and Leaf. Um, actually, is it made by the same company? I think it is made by. Okay. Uh, but we want to find the red chase packs. Look for red chase packs when they inserted in these blaster boxes or chase packs. Chase packs are one tenth production of the regular matte black cards. Um, so there's not going to be any NFL uniforms in here, and I don't even know. I guess it's like maybe they're even stripping off the college uniforms. But I think there's a better chance of like, uh, yeah, independent player license basically. Uh, official license. So I think there's a better chance of autos in these I believe um, so it looks okay who can, who can we get we can get Trevor Lawrence Justin Fields Zach Wilson Trey Lance Mac Jones Charles Trask so, so basically every uh, every big quarterback all the the big five quarterbacks you want to pull are in here though so maybe you don't want to put set poor Zach Wilson anymore and uh Uh, J but not and Devonte Smith, um, not Jamar Chase though, but maybe Jamar. So, and we didn't get a red chase back. But this was oh these are cool looking. These kind of look. Is this what Top Shot is based on? The, they're fake packs. Um, uh, but um, I think this these were thirty dollars at Walmart, and I know at like my. Local card shop, they're way more expensive than that. And then they were, I think, I've seen them people breaking them on, like people buying the whole box to break on, like, loop, and they're charging, like, ridiculous amount of monies for them. So. Okay. Alright, so let's see what we got. Um, okay. 
Oh, who is this? It was red. I saw it was Mac Jones, but Philippe Franks, Pat Framuth, uh, K. Johnson. It looks like he's wearing using a pacifier. Robert Rochelle, Jay Tuffle. All right, here we go. Devontae Smith. That's a keeper. Javon Holland, Chesterette. Oh, okay, and a Matt. A purple Matt Jalen Waddle and a rookie Heat Kyle Pitts. Okay, that's cool. So wait, I guess they're just photoshopping off like all the college the college logos. So these say Premier. So are these Wild Card? Okay, so they they seem very similar to uh, yeah, like I said, like the the leaf and the. Premier, the Leaf Premier, and the Sage. I got some decent pulls from one of those. I think I have some Gregory, I have Gregory Sows and I think a Mac Miller. No, not Mac Miller. <laughs> yeah, I have a Mac Miller Faces card. It's sweet. That would be sweet, actually. <laughs> Landon Dickerson. Carlos Basham. That's a cool name. Uh, Javante Williams. Okay, Najee Harris. All right, a uh, Zach Wilson. Another Najee Harris, the same card. Uh, Quiddy Pie. <laughs> okay, here we go. Trevor Lawrence. We pulled a Trevor Lawrence. And the Matt card for this one is Trevor Moor Mooring. And a Travis Et Etienne is the Matt card. Okay. So those are all, all right, maybe maybe they'll separate the just the regular mats and then the so maybe hopefully we'll pull a Lor like a Lawrence auto or something. Um, so there's eight parallel part or is there autos? I thought I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking of Leaf showing me. Okay, Sam Ellinger, who we thought maybe may, may have had a chance. Uh, Jalen Phillips, all the injuries. Another Devontae Smith. Rondell Moore. That's kind of a surprise for the Cardinals this year, right? Okay, Trey Lance. So we're getting a lot of the good quarter, a lot of the quarterbacks that were. Um, okay, Penny Sewell. Jason Owe. Uh, Davis Mills, kind of disappoint, disappointed. Okay. Greg Rousseau. That is the Matt, the Matt, the rookie heat one rather. And then an Eric Stokes is the wild, is the wild card Matt. So the purple, I guess it's the, oh, called purple explode. I guess you call that one. All right. Last pack of the first box. It's going faster than I thought. Um, Okay, another Quidi Pie, another Najee Harris, another Trevor Lawrence, another Zach Wilson. So we're already getting doubles in the first booster box. Landon Dickerson, another Najee Harris. So I've got three Najee Harrises already. Hunter Long, Javante Williams. Okay, cool. This is okay. So wait, it looks like an orange, or maybe just they do team killer explode. Kyle Pitts, though, that's a good, that's a good pull. And then another, uh, what do you call it? Weekend Heat, Rookie Heat, Weekend Warrior, Weekend Warrior, Travis Etienne. Oh, because they play on the weekends, even in college. Yeah, that's true. Okay. So last. Last box, and we've got last box. Oh, we've got pretty much all the big names on here. We haven't got J.C. Horn yet, or Patrick Sertain, but we've got every, We haven't pulled a Mac Jones, but we pulled. We haven't pulled Justin Fields yet either, but we've already pulled Trevor Lawrence and Trey Lance, Kyle Trask. So. I guess it doesn't, it doesn't say that there's even any 
Oh yeah, so okay. Oh, they're saying these subsets. Stripes, rookie heat, dueling guns. Which that that's probably the one you want to get, right? The dueling guns. The explode and the weekend warrior. Um actually doesn't it actually doesn't say that there's any I mean there's obviously not gonna be any relic relic cards, um, but there doesn't claim that there's gonna be any uh autographs at all even and i i think there was autographs though on i got i think there's autos in sage or leaf premiere draft again no chase pack just all but i gotta say these are nice these are really nice they look even though the cards themselves don't look premium these this wrapping looks premium so i'm a fan of that okay i would have been sitting weird the whole time i don't know why i was doing that all right Sitting on one of my, sitting on my foot. Okay, let's see what we got. All right. Um. Okay, Micah Parsons, Kadarius Tony. Who? Wait, he's the one that had that really one that one great game, and then also got basically suspended by the coach for the same game. Another Travis Motring, Tyson Campbell. Killen Hill, Micah Carter, uh, Greg Rousseau, who's having a good year. All right, Jared Patterson, Washington football team, preseason. Oh, okay, and a rookie heat, Kyle Trask. Nice. And a weekend warrior, Patrick Sertain the second. Nice. All right. I'm a fan of Jared Patterson. I think... I don't know. Uh, they, he hasn't had much opportunity yet this season. Um, I mean, they have two really good running backs there already with McKissick and Antonio Gibson. So, but I feel like he's a good. I don't know. He, he's a he's a good good like not not I'm not, I'm not gonna say change the pace. But they can all catch. He's more of a traditional running back, but he also can move. Jalen Phillips. Oh, Penny Sewell. All right. Devontae Smith. I think we've got almost all uh, Sam Ellinger again. J.C. Owe. So we've got almost every one that they listed on the box here. Elijah Moore. Another Davis Mills. All right, here, Justin Fields, finally. Cool. And then a Justin F or Javis Mills Weekend Warrior, which that was swipped. And then an Explode Jalen Waddle. All right. Yeah, so I think we've gotten all the marquee names that they that are all the marquee athletes in here. So now we just gotta hope for like we get like a Trevor Lawrence on one of the cart on Trey Lance uh, on one of the. Uh, Parallel cards. Devontae Smith. Okay. Rondell Moore again. Jalen Phillips. Oh man. Sam Ellinger. Uh huh. JC Owe. Another Justin Fields. Another Penny Sewell. Okay. Oh, look at the. Oh, cool. A oh, rookie Heat Patrick Sertain. That's cool. And I think, do we already get this Weekend Warrior Gregory or so? Alright, last pack. Hopefully it is something super awesome in here. Alright, it looks like we're, there's, I already saw it looks like there's, we already got a double. Okay, another Penny Sewell. Uh, JC Owen. Oh my gosh, Sam Ellinger. I feel like you could just... Just start tiling my floor with these Sam Ellinger. Um, Justin Fields. Jalen Phillips. Another Trey Lance. Another Rondell Moore. Another Devontae Smith. And I think we already got this. Jalen Waddle explode. And we definitely got this Greg Grosso. Um, okay. So we didn't get... The Trevor Lawrence for the big one. All right, so let's just go over the best cards real quick. Um, in terms in terms of 
before you get to the basketball. Uh, I think for sh uh, I, either the Frank Clark prism, orange prism, or the Shaw Alexander orange prism. It's it's retired. It's a retired guy and a defensive player, so neither of them is gonna be very pot, very that great. But and then when we look at there is a lot. Uh, um, I mean, we got a lot of the same. We got the same guys over and over again. We did get two. We got we got this Trevor Lawrence, which is very similar post to one of his Jaguars cards, for what I remember. Um, but I think that's probably the keep the the main the of the base cards. We'll say, and then um, in terms of the parallels I don't know what I would say uh, I really like the Kyle Pitts that's a really good I feel like that's a g good pull um, and then the the Jalen Waddle explode uh, the Gregory so I like I Gregory so is that's a cool I think it is a cool card as well as I like a He's a good player, but again on defense. Defense, and then we got the rookie heat, Jalen Patrick Sertain, which because cornerbacks are, I feel like are. This is just my theory. I don't know if this is true, but it seems like I would think that they get a little bit more money. They'd be a little more not money. They think they'd be more little valuable because they're sort of the higher, a more well known at their positions. Um, but who knows. Defensive cards are weird. All right, NBA time. NBA, NBA. So, like I said, we had they had I got all the different chronicles that they had. Uh, so, I think they were all similar. I think this is this one was like 15. This one was like 22, and then this one was more. Maybe this was 25, and then this one might have been 40. I don't remember. But, um, all right, this one has playbook base and bronze parallels. So let's start with the retail value pack. So, obviously, we want to pull. So, C Cade Cunningham, Cade Cunningham, Jalen Suggs. Uh, there's some other guy. I can't remember. The guys that won the MVP. Like, you don't, you don't really know. Like, the people that got the, that pulled Giannis. Rookie cards know that it was that they're gonna be worth so much money, or that he was gonna be so good. Probably not. Okay. Um. Jalen Johnson. Oh, so it looks like they got luminance in here as well. I like the I really like the look of the luminance cards. Cameron Thomas, I think is one of the one of the good, better players to pull. Requiem Gray. Okay, they got our Donis Raid rookie. That's kind of weird. Scotty Barnes. Franz Wagner tribute. That's another. That's one of the ones you'd want to pull. Um, it's one of the leader. The, see, the, the, this just seems like a mixture. So NBA hoops. So does that mean that we're not? If there, if there is an NBA hoops and a Donis in, in. in in the is chronicles does it mean that there's going to be all the nba hoops and don russ aren't going to be separate products this year oh look at this this is cool a flux jalen johnson that is that's cool i like that um i think these are going to be mostly rookie cards i isaiah jackson tribute Okay. Uh, what is this? A Keon Johnson? I think is this an explode? That's cool looking too. As well. Um, okay, so then this is a okay a Moses Mo Moody playbook. So that's one of the. Um, I think that's one that's 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 exclusive to the retail packs. Kai Jones raid rookie. Greg Brown tribute. Okay, here we go. Kid Cunningham, 
Cunningham Chronicles, Jane Springer Raid Rookie, NBA Hoops Tribute, Josh Christopher. That, these are cool designs. Just don't know what, and then Jared Butler Chronicles. Um, I just don't know why it seems like they put three products and put slam them all together for this year. Chronicles. Um, don't love Chronicles. I do like the way I do like the Luminance cards. The way I really enjoy their, their but they're not worth anything. They're basically base cards. But I wish, kind of wish that they'd get rid of Chronicles and just call it Luminance. Okay. So there's going to be 30 cards in here. Um, and then this is going to have... Okay. Uh, we want to look for Hollow, Hollow Rated Rookies, Mosaic Base Silver, Chronicles Rookie Signatures, Prestige Bonus Signatures. All right. So let's see if we get some signatures. I'm not going to read all this. Um, all right. Uh, so, two hanger box exclusive prestige base cards per box. So, which should be, so which, I think, what is the, I don't, I'm not sure what is exclusive to the hanger box, as opposed to what, I, I know the play, seems like the playbook is exclusive to the retail pack. Um, anyway, I wasn't planning on buying any, I look, I don't set up like a, board game cards. I wasn't planning on buying any basketball cards anytime soon because I was going to uh, wait because I already had all my basketball source set for the season. Oh, also, I got this card from an eBay, from the eBay account, the Prism. So, the three Prism packs I bought. This is a, it's actually not a terrible card. It's a rated rookie Mike Jaskaki. And it's also a Donruss Optic not hollow, but Donner's Optic. So that's pretty cool. I mean, I don't... They put tape over his face, but... It's not bad. That's not a bad card. It's, like, not a great card. But it's better than... It's, like... Better than getting a... I don't know. It's better than just getting a base card base, is what I'm saying. Even though, well, it is a base card. It's better, it's better than just, like, a Donner's base card, not Donner's Optic. All right. Let's check out what, the, what we have in this box. So, like I said, I don't know what the hanger box exclusives were going to be. Or we should be getting two. All right, Davian Mitchell, Reed Rookie. Trey Mann, NBA Hoops Tribute. Charles Bass Bassey, Chronicles. Luminance, Moses Moody. This is like, that's what I'm saying. I just like love the, the layouts and the color schemes of the Luminance. But, um... Okay, a Jalen Johnson raid rookie. Cameron Thomas and Bay Hoops. But this is the other thing is like I want I should have waited. I wanted to wait to buy any cards because I like we're who we're not gonna know how good any of these rookies are really until the end of the year. Okay, and then a tribute Cade Cunningham. That's cool. Okay, and then a tribute Jalen Suggs. So those are the two big guys you want to pull. Jonathan Kuma. Kuminga card, so this could be a good, a big card. Uh, Isaiah Jackson, Io Dustin, no, Keon Johnson. What? See, this is insane. And they stuck in, they stuck in a, a select rookie card. So what? Um, so just says select rookie is okay. So this one, this seems like they just put everything into these chronicles, I guess, because. But, like, you know, if it was another, if it was an actual select, it would say, like, court side con concourse. So it just says select. So I don't know what that means. This seems like a decent card. Maybe that's one of the pair, the, uh, a Jalen Green, Jalen Green tribute. Oh, this looks, this looks cool. Look at this. Uh, 20 Gala Kai Jones. Uh, or, oh, 22. It's just, just jersey number Gala. Uh, and explode Jaden Springer. I'm not sure which of these. 
And the other thing is, like, when the cards first, like, when packs first come out, you're not gonna, you don't really know. I mean, I guess you can do, you can do it based on just reading the back of the, in terms of the um, rarity of how much the cards are worth, but it's much easier once you know, once other people have started pricing things. A prestige Zier Williams. Wasn't he the kid that played against the Bronze Sun? Evan Mobley, Prestige. That could that could oh. And this one is actually numbered to ninety nine. So that's definitely the pull so far, I think, because that's the first number card we've gotten all night. So it's probably the pull for now. I've I have a few number cards. I only ever sold one and it was a UFC card. Jonathan Kuminga again. Isaiah Jackson Chronicles. Luminance Io Dustinuo. Kian Johnson Red Rookie. Corey Kispert Tribute. I think they're hoping that he's going to be really good, but who knows. Okay, Davion Mitchell, I think one, definitely one of the people you wanted to pull because he was the one that put up in Summer League, right, I think? The other IU uh, Chronicles. Keon Johnson. What else we And a Corey Kispert, Raid Rookie. Davion Mitchell, Bay Hoops Tribute. And a Trey Man Chronicles. And a Luca Garza, the other Luca, not who, if I, if I recall, had a pretty decent, actually had a decent um, Olympics, right? That Luca Garza. Um, all right, all right. So now this one is five packs, four, five cards in a pack, four packs per box. So. That's not the same as that's the same as the hanger, isn't it? The twenty cards. Um, yeah, twenty cards. So what? Twenty cards and twenty cards. Oh, actually, the hanger box had more. But I think the, I feel like the the hanger box had thirty cards, but I think that the blaster box was more expensive. Um, there's optic rated rookies in here. A uh, bunch of autographs. Potential. There's threads and swatches. So there's some jersey cards or other cards. Okay, so we've pulled a number card. We haven't pulled. We haven't pulled any signatures tonight or any relic cards. So hopefully we'll pick. This one we'll pick one. Maybe I'm imagining. It. I feel like I don't know. It's, it seemed to me like the booster box was more expensive. It's, Seems like it has more rare parallels, I think. And it's like a nicer setup. Um, I mean, it just feels like a more expensive product. Yeah, because they just had everything just like tied together. Yeah, it's just this is four separate actual car packs. So, is this going to have. Um, it doesn't have the code to get your free cards for that for their Panini games. Okay, let's see what we got here. Luminance Isaiah Jackson. Another okay. Another IO Raid Rookie. Okay. We have a okay, this looks pretty cool. A select Jalen Suggs. Uh again, doesn't say what kind of um Okay, and a Pink, I think a pink explode Scotty Barnes. That's cool. Or maybe team colors. And then a rookie and stars raid rookie Jalen Johnson. So I don't know if that's different. I'm guessing that might be slightly different from the regular rookie card. Yeah, but I'm not going to... Okay, a Keon Johnson tribute card. Another Corey Kispert. Kai Jones, Pink Luminous. 
And here we go with a Moses Moody Explode. Uh, and then a rookie and stars Jalen Suggs. Okay, we got two packs left, so that's half our way through the booster box, which yes, technically less cards, but I think the parallels are a little bit nicer. Okay, Davian Mitchell Luminous. Okay, uh, pink. Greg Brown Raid Rookie. Oh, okay. Jonathan Kuminga Don Rust Raid Rookie opti uh, Optic. Oh, look how cool this looks. Kai Jones. That's a cool looking card. I don't. It looks fancier, but there's nothing that indicates it's any kind of parallel. It looks really cool. And then a Rookie and Stars Moses Moody. Last pack. So let's get. Let's get a signature in this pack. All right, I'm gonna try to open it without looking. Oh, I was able to do it. Okay. Trey Man Raid rookie. Tribute Charles Bassey. Ooh, look at this. Uh, Cade Cunningham, and it is. I can't really tell. It's a purple parallel. And then a Jaden Springer. Um, E. Is that an Elements card? And then a Rookie and Stars Kid Cunningham. Okay, that's a pretty cool. All right. Okay, so in terms of basketball, I mean, who knows if somebody in here becomes the next Giannis or somebody like that. Who knows? But, uh,. I think we got some decent Cade Cunninghams out of this. And then some Jalen Suggs, select Jalen Suggs, but I, th I mean, the one that, I mean, I don't know how, who knows. The one that looks, this one looks the fanciest, this Jalen Johnson. And it has a prism, it says prism on the back. None of the other ones even say that. So that's a legitimate prism. The other ones are, they could be parallels, but they're not prisms. And like I said, like I said, the selects are not, um, but a decent amount of, and the, let's put all the cades, we'll put all the cades together in a second. This Jane Spring, I mean, it just looks real fancy. And like I said, this one, I think is a base card, but look how fancy it looks for a base card. And then the Donors Optic Raid Rookie. And of course, the number to 99, Evan Mobley. And we had two K Cunninghams, a NBA hoops, um, because purple or pink NBA, NBA hoops tribute parallel, and then this is just a base rookie and stars. But I don't know. If he, yeah, it just depends on how K does this year. If he becomes like the rookie of the year, then obviously it'll be all his cards will be worth something. But so that's it for the night. Um, like I said, I've been going to all the different, whenever I go to Target or Walmart or Walgreens, I check and there's almost never any, sometimes there's stuff there. So, um, I might buy some more, might, I might order some booster packs off like Steel City or something and then, but in the next month, but I thought for now, I think that's going to be it for a while. So until next time, take it easy, everybody.